Meanwhile, China is trying to exploit the death of its ambassador to Israel, its own ambassador. His name was Du Wei. He was 57 years old. He died at his residence near Tel Aviv. There was no evidence of foul play. But conspiracy theorists have been pushing far-fetched reports on the internet for clicks linking a Chinese ambassador's death in Israel to the visit of an American secretary. And this is just what China needed. Here's what followed. May 17th, 10 kilometers north of Tel Aviv. Staff at the residence of the Chinese ambassador to Israel make an urgent phone call to the local police. A team of cops arrives at the scene within minutes. Shortly after they enter the residence, a statement is issued. The Chinese ambassador Du Wei has been found dead in his bedroom. Initial findings suggest no foul play. There are no signs of violence either and there is no immediate comment on his death by Chinese officials present there. Du Wei died in his sleep due to natural causes. The Chinese Foreign Ministry decides to abide by the preliminary verdict. Any wrongdoing in the Chinese ambassador's demise is officially ruled out. But the story does not die and conspiracy theories begin to take shape. Du Wei was 57 years old and had taken charge as the Chinese envoy to Israel in February. Upon his arrival in Tel Aviv, he had undergone a 14-day home quarantine. And in the weeks that followed, Du Wei, much like other Chinese diplomats, had become increasingly critical of the US government. He had publicly argued that China was being made a scapegoat for the pandemic. In fact, on Friday, the Chinese embassy in Israel had specifically called out the US Secretary of State. It had called Mike Pompeo's statement on Chinese investments in Israel absurd and had demanded evidence for his claims. The response, which is now bizarrely being linked to the Chinese ambassador's death. What's adding fuel to this theory is the fact that Mike Pompeo visited Israel just last week. But conspiracy theorists have only played into China's hands. Because now the Chinese regime has decided to give an official stamp to their theory. China is sending a team to independently investigate Du Wei's death. Beijing says that its envoy may have died of natural causes, but it is necessary to examine the details around his demise. As the Chinese regime prepares for another offensive, this time in Israel, the world must not get distracted by the issue at hand. Coronavirus cases have crossed the 4.7 million mark. Bureau report, Weon World is One.